Good evening. A Perth father is behind bars tonight, charged with killing his son and burying him in the backyard of the family home. The dead man's brother and sister are also in jail, accused of helping clean up after the murder. As the search for Matthew Fisher-Turner went on for weeks, his family home was hiding a terrible secret. His body buried in a dirt grave in the backyard, the 24-year-old allegedly killed by his dad and two siblings. It's going to be before the courts. So I won't go into the family dynamic, the relationships, etc., other than to say that um, the, the accused at this point all lived at that address. His 65-year-old father, Ernie Fisher, has been charged with murder. His 19-year-old sister, Hannah, and older brother, Joshua, charged with helping to conceal the crime. Their court appearance was brief. This man who knew the family yelled out, you're despicable, Ernie, inside court. Matthew, a talented lacrosse player, was last seen alive on October 1st and reported missing two weeks later. His girlfriend was at Matt's Parmelia home when his body was dug up last night. Today, she and dozens of others posted tributes on social media. I'm sorry, I'm just, I'm really heartbroken about this. I can't believe he was actually murdered. I hope, I was praying that they would have just found him, that he just ran away for a bit to get his head cleared, but no, it turns out he was, yeah, he was gone this whole time. Detectives say it was Matthew's friends who first raised the alarm something sinister could have gone on here. They'd been to this house and spoken with the 24-year-old's family after he disappeared. They grew suspicious and then went to police. Police won't say how or why Matthew was killed, but at some point the blood bond was strong. The 24-year-old bearing the words family first on his arm. Alice Pooley, Nine News.